Hello, dear student. Welcome to IMS Gate Academy. I am Ankur Sharma, and in this session, uh, we will have one more success story. So we are having Himani Himali Saini with us today, and uh, she has secured All India tenth rank, All India rank ten in Gate two zero two two exam in Computer Science branch. So most welcome Himali, and uh, first of all, many many congratulations to you on the behalf of IMS Gate Academy. thank you so much really a great achievement that you have secured 10th rank in gate 2022 even you are uh, right now in final year as you have told so my first question to you uh, like kaisa lag raha hai abhi aapko aur dusra what is your academic background in which year you have passed out like uh, already to told that right now you are in final year so uh, overall uh, journey ke bare mein thoda sa bataiye aur ye bataiye ki what is your actual score in the gate Okay. Out of thousand, yes. Out of thousand, my score is nine fifty one, and mark seventy point six seven, and rank, just like you have said, like tenth rank. So actually, my preparation journey started from third year itself. Like uh, as soon as the notice came that third year students can also give gate exam, I had started preparing, and like at that time, I had targeted easy subjects like. Uh, which were there in my semester exams also like operating system database management and data structures all those subjects so um, like i had completed around 4 to 5 subjects uh, till february and uh, and taken one test series that is ims gate academy at that time and uh, given the exam so like uh, with half preparation i managed to score around 35 marks at that time which i felt is good up to my expectations so we are only in 21 yes 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 so after that uh, i focused on the remaining subjects and like my strategy was first to get conceptual clarity on every topic and like after the topic is clear i used to uh, practice previous year questions from that topic and give a topic wise test from the test series and then like after the subjects were completed i used to give subject wise test also and uh, the other important thing is usually students get bored when only one subject is studied continuously so i used to uh, like mix and match two three subjects ek sath kabhi man kiya to maths ho gaya kabhi aptitude de diya masti masti mein so like i uh, used to make it interesting every day was like kind of different and other than that one more inspiration for me was to get all the subjects uh, clarity was because placements were coming i was uh, in the end of my third year and i had heard that uh, like not heard it is true that in placements one of the round includes uh, mcqs which are covered in gate also and also like one interview session in which they ask these concepts so uh, like um, somehow because i studied for gate i also got placed तो तो मेरा प्लेसमेंट जल्दी हो गया था तो उसके वजह से मुझे बाकी का टाइम भी मिल गया तो आफ्टर दैट माय जर्नी कंटिन्यूड एंड आई फिनिश्ड ऑल ऑफ माय सब्जेक्ट्स इन अराउंड आई थिंक इन अक्टूबर यस सो आफ्टर अक्टूबर दैट इज इन फ्रॉम नवंबर डिसम्बर जनवरी आई ओनली रिवाइज एंड गेव मॉक टेस्ट सो लाइक दैट वॉज अ ब्रीफ ओवरव्यू ऑफ माई जर्नी Good, good, good. So as Himali, you have told that you have completed all the subjects till October only, so that you are getting enough time to revise them and you are getting enough time to evaluate yourself in the test series, like subject test or mock test. Mm -hmm. So when you have started the mock test, actually that will actual uh, that generally actual gives the feeling of gate exam, like total sixty five question in three hour. Mm -hmm. So have you appeared for the mock test and by when you have started? Yes, so, so like first in uh, around November, I finished all the subject tests and like uh, some topics of uh, COA and CN, which uh, like I didn't like, like they were kind of difficult and so I had kept them from uh, for last. So I slowly completed them also and like uh, actually, अभी तक भी कुछ topics हैं जो मैंने नहीं पढ़े हैं but uh, yeah, uh, so I focused on my strong points. Perfect. so in around december i started giving full length uh, mocks and i think that's the most important part which actually helped me because studying is one thing and attempting the questions in those 3 hours with proper time management and uh, uh, like uh, ignoring the pressure and uh, 
all that thing is more important so i gave around 40 mocks which uh, is uh, like a large number because uh, uh, and when i started the mocks i used to score in around 50s but with more practice and practice my range increased to around 65 to 75 and that's only because after every mock i used to note down kaun si silly mistakes hai like for example uh, initially i used to do into two ka bhi mistake ho jata tha plus minus ka mistake ho jata so i made sure that every time i read the question twice and even before attempting i'm reading ki kya puch hai true hai false hai so all those points were noted and also time management is very important so what i used to do is in the first round uh i used to target the easy and direct questions so i used to start from general aptitude actually some of my friends they did opposite and they attempted aptitude at last but for me uh, what worked was starting with aptitude so like easy questions i attempt uh, in the first round uh, and then followed by easy questions of technical and then uh, for the second round some questions which i know are easy but lengthy like they can take time so in the second round i used to target those questions and i think by uh, by two rounds uh, i i used to attempt more around i think 40 35 to 40 questions uh, were completed by this time and then the difficult questions were left so for uh, the third round like um, i used to think jiska mujhe at least thoda to idea hai i usko fir main zyada time deke kar leti thi like because i knew difficult strategy actually first we need to focus and first we need to target for our strength only so that initially you get the confidence and initially your moral is up only so after that even even this uh, even some question that you have doubt and you are not 100% sure even those questions you you can also do correctly if your confidence is high so initially this approach actually works so i am also suggesting to all the future get aspirants that as uh, himali uh, told that uh, you should always go for the easier approach also so whatever subject is your strength that you think first of all you need to approach that questions first of all okay whether they are one marks or two marks whatever you need to solve the question in different different round as the himali told like in the first round you need to attempt the easier question after that you need to attempt the easy but lengthy question like that you need to uh, uh we can say that differ the different different rounds it will definitely works and uh, initially when you will solve 10 20 30 questions and you you know very well that all the questions are correct only because you are you are having the you are matching with the answer also so that that gives you positive energy in the examination hall and actually we need to handle the pr- uh, pressure also that is uh, but obvious there in the exam in the 3 hour so Uh, very good imali this is a very good point that will be i think it is very much beneficial for the uh, future gate aspirants whoever will write the gate 23 or 24 so one more impressive th- thing is what you have secured the gate rank in the final year only and it is itself a big achievement because generally uh, generally the student who secured the single digit rank or the two digit rank now those are generally dropper like one year or two year dropper but uh, what is the best part with you that uh, still you have not uh, received your final year degree but still uh, but uh, you have now get score card with 10 rank so it is a matter of uh, proud and definitely uh, it's a proud moment for us also for you also for your parents also so i'm very happy <laughs> uh, so now my next question is this that like what are the general uh, challenges that you have faced during your uh, preparation so one of the major challenge was uh, like uh, after solving like when i uh, used to solve pyqs of any subject for the first time and like even after thinking so much uh, like nahi ban pate the starting mein like initial due to uh, during the initial stage so i used to get so much demotivated ki yahan pe ghar pe apne room mein baith ke nahi ban pa rahe exam mein kaha se banenge but then like uh, um maine socha like with uh, i still kept on trying like uh, i after trying for 20 to 25 minutes thoda sa hint le liya solution se and like hint lene ke baad ye nahi ki pura dekh lo hint liya but then uske baad bhi we need to try on our own like we need to improve our thinking uh, capacity and skills so after that i used to try on my own and still like you know eventually what uh, i came to realize is that as 
uh, i'll practice more and more my analytical st- uh, skills will improve like uh, the uh, capability of solving new questions so uh, that initially was challenging but with time i somehow overcame it and the other part was that revision was uh, very boring for me See, studying the same thing again and again it is not easy because lagta hai already ki sab aata to hai yaar fir se padh ke kya karna hai but it but you know in uh, like when the mistake i did was sometimes i used to skip it and then while attempting test like i padha tha but ab yaad nahi aa raha so <laughs> yeah like luckily i realized it at that time only and not in the real exam so that <laughs> if i force myself ki i don't want this to happen in the real exam so i will like keep on revising it again and again till like pura bad jaye wo man mein so that is also like in general my class i also suggest to students that you need to focus more and more on revision because uh, like uh, and and uh, as you told that you have completed the subject till october now so this is the best time actually because uh, in the month of december uh, you cannot afford that you will start a new subject and new new learning uh, you, are, you are getting so it is not correct way actually so jo bhi aapko padhna hai at least aap october tak finish kare and you need to ensure that ki after november you are not supposed to start any new subject any new concept first time you need to keep revise again and again again and again and do more and more practice as the himari told uh, whether you can uh, you can appear for subject tests also chapter test also and test series also and you can revise the pyqs also okay so this is the oral suggestion to all our all uh, gate future aspirants so i think uh, more or less all the questions we have covered himali so many many congratulations once again to you yeah. and uh, in last uh, i just want to conclude uh, like from your side if you wish to conclude i am giving you two minute time just to conclude uh, like as far as your experience is concerned for the gate exam and uh, whatever is your journey uh, okay you have feel that so please conclude in the next two minute and after that we will end the session yes sir. so like to all the future aspirants i would like to say initially it will feel that uh, the syllabus is very vast and so much of practice is required but daroma it, it is very interesting like when you get started you will automatically get into the flow of uh, first studying and then practicing and like giving mocks is also really fun and uh, you know when there are many students and you get to see the rank and compete with each other that is like a healthy competition and one more important thing is not to get stressed out during the exam and this cannot happen just by thinking ki mujhe tension nahi lena hai us din nahi you know you need to have this mindset from the first day itself like enjoy and study like don't study for the whole day i used to study for only around 5 to 6 hours uh, 6 hours daily but i was consistent and for the other time i used to like relax and do other activities also and like i never uh, had a pressure on myself that i need to get a rank under 100 or under 500 also i just thought i need to uh, have clear concepts and i need to practice a lot and whatever happens will happen so like that's you what you need to me. give your best only but yes. just think about that ki i will try my level best whatever will happen it is not in my hand it is not in uh, yeah. like in, in our hand so uh, this is the very good mindset because, because generally what i have feel that sometimes students are uh, student feel that like it is a it is a do and die situation for me if this time if i will not create the rank then uh, like to aisa kuch nahi sochna chahiye because unnecessary agar aap is tarah sochoge then aap apne aap ko pressure mein leke aa jate ho so usse kya hota hai ki jo aapka actual performance hai wo bhi nikal ke nahi aa pata 3 hours so this is a very good point that each and every learner should note down that you are not supposed to think much about the future that what will happen what will happen if my rank will not come then what will happen like these types of uh, thing you need to avoid however it will come automatically but you need to avoid you need to avoid and you need to focus that whatever knowledge you have gained in the last one year you just need to attempt that with 100% accuracy and with 100% you just try to give your best in the 3 hour that should be your mindset because uh, if you will go for uh, like for the, this mindset na definitely you will get uh, more than you are expecting that you are definitely get but whenever you feel that uh, you are feeling nervous and you are uh, you are feeling like that it is a it is a do and die situation sir for me so in their situation many students even they uh, 
they know the concept even they are very intelligent but still they are not able to get the good rank because of they are not able to manage the three r pressure and all so uh, thank you so much himali for coming and sharing your experience it will be definitely very much beneficial for the gate uh, learners and the future gate aspirants so all the gate future aspirants uh, thank you so much for watching the session and bye bye take care and definitely you guys can subscribe the channel so that uh, whenever any new video will come you will get the instant notification and uh, definitely this success story the purpose of this success story is what so that uh, whatever the student experience you guys will uh, get that experience and definitely it will be very much beneficial in your gate preparation journey and uh, whenever you will write the gate in 24 and 23 definitely you will uh, it will be uh, very beneficial for you okay guys so bye bye take care that's all from the session thank you